Liverpool have been handed a major injury boost ahead of the visit to Anfield of Steven Gerrard's Aston Villa at the weekend, with Roberto Firmino back training amongst his teammates in Kirby. The Brazilian forward has been missing since the 2 all draw with Brighton at the end of October, but it appears now that he'll be back in contention very shortly, with a full injury update from Jurgen Klopp to come in his press conference on Friday. Diogo Jota was not pictured on any of the training pitches, but anyone else did appear to be there, including Joe Gomez and Naby Keita, who returned from injuries of their own in the midweek victory over AC Milan in the Champions League. The likes of Thiago Alcantara, Mohamed Salah and Jordan Henderson were all present as Jurgen Klopp oversaw the session under the lights while it was reported that Harvey Elliott did some work on his own with a ball for the first time as he continues his recovery. Elliott is still some weeks away from a return but it was said last week that the player is hopeful he can return to team training at some stage in January. Cade Gordon and Elijah Dixon Bonner were among the young players who were involved in the session, as was Tyler Morton after his exceptional performance at the San Siro. After making eight changes midweek in Europe, plenty more can be expected on Saturday as Aston Villa come to town, with Thiago Fabinho and Virgil van Dijk among those expected to come back into the starting eleven. Liverpool could be four points behind Premier League leaders Manchester City at kickoff should Pep Guardiola's men beat Wolves in the early game, but anything other than a win for City at the Etihad Stadium could hand the Reds the chance to leapfrog them. Chelsea, meanwhile, take on Leeds United at Stamford Bridge. That game is at the same time as Liverpool versus Aston Villa.